Today, I'm going to give you a demonstration of a new AI tool that is taking the Facebook ads world by storm. It's a chat based AI tool, and you can essentially ask it to research and plan your Facebook ad craves for a particular product in a particular market, and it'll do it in a mere matter of minutes with an incredible level of customization and relevancy to what you're selling and who you're advertising to. That includes writing the actual copy and even writing scripts for videos that you can film and pair with that copy. So it is incredibly powerful. It is called ChatGPT and it's only been out for like two weeks. And in the first week it had over 1 million users alone. So really growing traction fast. And if you haven't heard about it already, you're gonna hear a lot more about it after this video because it's definitely gonna disrupt things. And the best bit about it, currently it is completely free. So rather than me explain what ChatGPT is to you, before we jump into the demonstration, I'm just gonna quickly ask it and tell you what it says. Because after all, it is AI, it's chat-based, it's extremely powerful. Let's get it to explain itself, okay? So I asked the chat, um, ChatGPT, can you explain what you are? And it is basically said, I am an artificial intelligent assistant trained to answer questions and provide information on a wide, wide range of topics, including general knowledge, history, science, current events, and many other subjects. So it's probably being quite modest there. That seems very high level, but this, this chat can write code for websites. You could, people have used it to write full, uh, write code for full websites. People have used it to write essays, write blogs, um, write copy, like I said. But it's not just that you're writing the copy or writing the blog. You can then go in and ask it to amend it, ask it to make the language more formal, make the language more simple. Can you make it shorter? Can you make it longer? Can you make it for this particular market? Can you mention this thing in it? Like it's incredible the level of customization you can do via the chat, okay? And then I asked it how, uh, who created you? So it said, I was, open, I was created by OpenAI, a research organization that focuses on developing and promoting friendly artificial intelligence. OpenAI is a leader in the field of artificial intelligence research and development and is dedicated to creating AI technologies that are safe and beneficial to humanity. Okay, so yeah, it's created by OpenAI. It's completely free. I think you might have to wait a little bit, but I recommend you all go and jump on it and get on the waiting list if that is the case so you can have a play of it after you've watched this video because you're going to see how powerful it is. Okay, so let's jump on to ChatGPT now. Okay, so this is ChatGPT. I have a, a pre-made flow, which I will show you after, just because it has to write things, and which takes time. So I don't want you to have to sit around watching me write things and let it think. Um, but it is quick, but I'll just show you, you know, you can ask this like, um, write me a blog, or no, let's not do write, let's say, uh, plan me a blog on using, AI and Facebook ads. Okay, so what it's gonna do is it's gonna plan the blog, just the different sections. So you can see now it's thinking, so it says sure. And it's gonna give me an outline of the actual blog. So that's the different sections of my blog. And then once that's done, I could then go and ask it to actually write each of those sections. So I could just say write the full blog, but I would, I would like to go and ask it, okay, so write the introduction. Let's see. Let's just give it a bit of time to write more information. Okay, so there you can see, right? It's done, it's given me the intro, the benefits of using AI, how to use AI, case studies, and a conclusion. I can then say, um, write the introduction with uh, a catchy hook or something, okay? And it's then going to go and start writing that. So I don't want to dwell upon this or, or, or waste time. There you go. So there's writing a catchy hook and the introduction, okay? I don't want to waste time doing that because like I said, it's got some thinking time and it's going to type it all out. So it will save your workflow a lot, but for the purpose of this video, I don't want you to have to sit and watch that. 
So what I've done is I've pre-made a typical flow that you might be using for Facebook ads. And I can show you just how powerful this is and give you some inspiration on how you can use it yourself. So I've said to it, um, first of all, what are the, so this is for basically the example of a sleep, a natural sleep supplement. I will first want to get what is the problems people are facing so I can target the problems. You know, if you're doing research, you'll be getting the problems. So it's what are the core reasons people have for not getting good sleep? Okay. So it's come and given me the core reasons. So stress or anxiety, poor sleep hygiene, medical conditions, medications, substance use like alcohol, caffeine, uh, poor diet and age. As you get older, you also get worse sleep. Okay, now if I just asked it to write me ads on all of them, it, it could do that, but I'm trying to be more strategic. So I now have that. I could copy that and put it in a separate document. That's the research phase done. I mean, those are those are the reasons. That would have taken me, what, maybe 30 minutes to go and look at different blogs and summarize all of those. It's incredible how good this is. It's pulling the information from all over the internet. Um so many different sources and finding out what you really want to know based on what you've asked. Okay. So those are the different reasons. And then it's given me some blurb here, you know, it's conversational. So it gives you some extra information. So I've then gone and asked it, um, create some headlines for a natural sleep supplement around improving stress or anxiety. So I've taken the first one. That's something you could do. You could have your list and then you could do separate chats asking each one of these. And here's a typical flow that's going to take me from asking about the specific hook it's given me or the specific problem to getting headlines, getting copy, getting a video, and even getting the script for the video all in one thing. And I'll show you the customization. So it is said, here are a few potential headlines for a natural sleep supplement focused on improving stress or anxiety. So get a better night's sleep with our natural stress leaving sleep supplement. Say goodbye to anxiety in your sleepless nights with our all natural sleep aid. Okay, and then a couple more, which, you know, seem quite good. I've then said, make these suitable for Facebook ads because I felt some of them were a bit, they weren't really marketing style enough. And also they might be saying things like anxiety that we don't really want to be using too much on Facebook ads. Or the, or the way it was phrasing anxiety, I didn't really like how it's been phrased for Facebook ads, okay, for the Facebook ad rules. So I said, make these suitable for Facebook ads and it's amended them. So here are some headlines with a few adjustments. So it said, get a better night's sleep with our natural stress leaving sleep supplement. Try it today. So it's giving you a call to action because I've said it's been used for Facebook ads. It's added a call to action. Suffering from anxiety in your sleepless nights, our all natural sleep aid can help try it now. Okay, another call to action. So really the main thing it's done here is it's taken the same things, but it's added call to actions it might not have the level of intelligence yet to be able to know what Facebook's ad policies are. Okay, so maybe that's something it can't do yet. Um, but we can take those pre-made headlines and use them. But if, if, you, if you run Facebook ads, you know, these are quite long. These are probably, these could be used as headlines for ad copy, but they couldn't be used for the actual headlines on the ads. So I've simply said to it, make these shorter. And it's gone and done that. So natural sleep supplement for stress relief all natural sleep aid for anxiety, induced sleep, sleeplessness, fall asleep faster with a stress reducing sleep supplement. Okay. So it's made them shorter, shorter. You could input them into Facebook ads right now, or you could take your human eye and make them even shorter, whatever. The purpose of this isn't to replace copywriters. It's just that it can aid what you're doing and give you the inspiration, get past brain fog and really, really, really shorten your your workflow save you a lot of time okay so look at all this different inspiration i've got around this stress and anxiety angle how long would that have taken me to make if i was trying to think about it myself so i've then said to choose the best three of these because we let's just work with three for now so it's given me some background behind why it's only it can't choose three. you know it's saying it's difficult to determine which of the headlines would be the best for a specific situation or audience um but it has given me some that might be effective. Okay, so fall asleep faster, deep breaths of sleep, natural sleep aid for peaceful sleep. I could even ask it to make these for a particular person. So I could say make these headlines specific to 
people in their 50s or people over 50 and it, it would amend them to relate to that or people or, or to women or to men, like whatever, you can make it customized, which is super, super, um, <laughs> it's, it's almost scary, but it's very interesting too. Then you say, then I've said specify that is a natural sleep supplement in each. Okay, so now it's going to add that um, we have a natural sleep supplement. So I didn't really need to get to do that. I could do that myself, but I'm just showing you how like, I'm just giving you a demonstration of what it can do. And then I've said, write one piece of Facebook ad copy that I could use with each headline. So now I'm going to get it to take each of these headlines and write me the copy that goes with them. Okay, so he copy one, tired of tossing and turning due to stress. Our natural sleep supplement is specifically designed to help you relax and fall asleep faster. Give it a try tonight and see the difference for yourself. That looks like it was written by a human. Like you would not be able to tell that that was a machine. Like look how, how human that seems, how good it seems. And it's based on this headline, fall asleep faster, <laughs> starts with the problem, tired of, and storytelling, tired of, tired of tossing and turning due to stress. Like this is super powerful, okay? But I wanted now to get this, I wanted to get these uh, as longer versions. So I said, make the first one longer. I just want to go with the first one. So it's taking that headline, say goodbye to sleepless nights, I don't think that's the same headline. So it's made a, it's made a new headline, but you know it's no problem. We can just um, you have to you have to play about it. But sometimes there's too much information. Like sometimes it would have been better to me to just take this, copy it, you know, copy it and then paste it in the chat and say rewrite this or make this longer uh, because it's probably gone back to the first headline from the very top. It's not understood that I'm talking about this one here, okay? But anyway, it doesn't matter. We, we'll still continue. So it's given me the, the headline and copy. So if you're struggling to get a good night's sleep, you're the stress and anxiety, or not sleep might maybe the solution you've been looking for. Okay, so it's, it's beefed it up a bit. Then I've said to it, can you plan a video for this copy and headline? So it's gone and planned me a video, introduce the problem, introduce the solution, show the benefits, share testimonials, call to action, end with a final message. And it's given me the actual how to do it. So it's given me some starters, the natural ingredients in our supplement are designed to calm the mind. So it's given me the actual talking points, the hooks that I should do. But obviously we can take it one step further. And if you want to be lazy, I can just say, listen, just write me a script for this video that, that an actor could read. So it's given me the full script. On screen, a person lying in bed, looking at the clock it's giving you the, you the full video like the storyboard and the script that is how that would take you hours to do that, that literally this would take you hours to do and it's done it and uh this took like 30 seconds for it to write this okay so yeah i'm not gonna read all this but it's very good i, I what i might do at some point is i might take some of these and actually get them made up and use them in ads and then I can feed back how they perform. But yeah, for now it's just showing a demonstration. And then what I've done is, cause I missed it earlier, but um, I've asked it, so the copy we had earlier, I've asked it to basically add some emojis. So I've copied the copy and I pasted it in and said, can you add some emojis to this copy? And it's gone and added, added emojis. I've not told it what emojis to add. It is gone and picked ones relevant to what it's talking about. So it's, it knows it's about, it knows it's talking about sleep. It knows this is the kind of face you do with stress and anxiety. Natural has like the green things, feeling refreshed, the sun, rejuvenated, strong, like it's crazy powerful, okay? How smart this thing is. And then this is me trying to be a bit too granular and it's not working. Okay. So this is, there, there are some limitations. I've said no more than three emojis and it's come and just added the same thing, I think, or no more than, I don't really know what's done here, but it, it's not understood it. So then I've said, can you rewrite this with less emojis? And also it's just removed them. So there are limitations, but you have to play and see what those limitations are. But of course, as a tool to aid you as a human, this is where it becomes powerful. It's not to replace you it is to aid what you're already doing, save you time, like I said earlier. And then I've said, can you add that our supplement contains ashwagandha, chamomile, and lavender? 
and it's gone and taken this copy and added it, okay? So you can make lots of different iterations to what you're doing. So that's just an example of one flow. I could then go and take all those, create ads from them, test them in the market, see what works, and then go and, you know, try and iterate on it myself. I don't see this as being a thing of trying to, you know, beat the AI or like you and the AI have a competition. I see it as being something to help you generate ideas, save time when you don't have time to do things, you know, give you the start for 10 and then you can maybe put your input on it, put your spin on it, put it into Facebook, let the machine tell you what's working, let the market tell you what's working. And then you can either put that back into the AI or you can make your own iterations collaboratively. Like people who are talking about A-B testing, you know, their own copywriters against the AI. I don't think it should be something that you're always trying to have two channels with. Just use it to help your workflow, help you save time. And yeah, use it as an aid rather than something to try and beat copywriters or whatever. I think there's still a place for all those different roles. There's still a uh, uh, an argument that you need to learn those skills. You need to get better at doing those different things. You need to get better at being creative, writing copy, planning videos, looking at what competitors are doing. All that is still relevant, but for generating things from what you're getting, this will save you a lot of time. Now, of course, there are some limitations. Obviously, this is pulling information from the internet, and that's only going to give it so much granularity. Obviously, if you have a, a very specific product or you are you're talking a very specific market, it might not be able to give you stuff as granular as that. I've just shown you for sleep, maybe sleep's a big topic, but it's been able to get quite granular. But what I think you can do is if you have data on, if you're getting data back on your ads and you're getting data from your audience, you can take that data that it doesn't know because it's not on the internet and you can feed that into the machine. So I can say, right, I, I'm seeing a pattern in my Facebook ads that this, uh, I don't know, the sleep supplement is being used not for people who want to sleep, but maybe it's being used for people who want to relax more. And that's not what's been shown on the internet. It's been used more of like a stress relief thing. Now, obviously this is a, an example that does exist, but like, let's say that's the data I was getting and that wasn't the thing that was being talked about or discussed on the internet. I could say, now take this and, and make it relevant to people who are, or let's say menopause, make it relevant to people who are suffering the menopause because that's where I'm seeing people are actually getting the benefit of the supplement because those ingredients also have that double function that they're good for that, 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 I don't know, that situation or that situation or the ailments that come with it. Okay. That's how you could see it. I see you could take your own data and feed it back into the model. Okay. So I could talk about this all day. Uh, it's still an unknown thing. Obviously people are still trying to figure it out. I'm still trying to figure it out, but I hope you've enjoyed the demonstration. I'll leave a link to ChatGPT in the description. Like I said, go jump on it, have a play around and see what you can figure out and just watch the space, watch YouTube. I feel the more stuff will be coming out in the coming weeks uh, and months. And yeah, they're obviously gonna be developing this tool too and it's only gonna, get, only gonna get better as well as other AI stuff in the market because there's a lot of AI tools that are actually really beneficial and helpful in Facebook ads. Okay. So thanks for watching guys. And I will see you in another video very soon.